Hello and welcome to the Willie and Stops TV community. Today I am your host and together we will explore the top 10 most scariest toys part 2. These toys were designed for children, but they are so creepy that they can cause nightmares even in the bravest adults. Let's begin. Number 10. Zuni Warrior Doll. The Zuni Warrior Doll is a toy doll that appears in the 1975 horror film Trilogy of Terror. The doll is from the Zuni tribe and is possessed by an evil spirit. The movie follows a woman who receives the doll as a gift and unknowingly frees it from the amulet that kept it sealed. The doll comes to life and chases the woman throughout the house in a series of chilling scenes. The Zuni Warrior Doll has become an icon of horror cinema and is still remembered for its impactful performance. Number 9. Hugo, Man of a Thousand Faces in the 1970s, a game called Hugo, Man of a Thousand Faces, was released, which included a half-body figure of a bald man with a rubber head and cotton-filled arms. The game was somewhat unsettling from the start and involved sticking different elements onto the doll to dress him up. The aim of the game was for kids to use their imagination and creativity to create different characters for the doll. But the problem was that the special glue that came with the toy didn't last long and other types of glue couldn't be used to fix the pieces. Despite the game not being very successful, many people nostalgically remember the unsettling appearance of the bald man and the arms that moved with a string. Although, overall, it was considered a strange toy, it was one of the most peculiar of the 1970s. Hi, my name is Teddy Ruxpin. Number 8. Teddy Ruxpin. Teddy Ruxpin is a toy that went on sale in 1985. He was a teddy bear who told stories to children. Although it was very popular at the time and became the best-selling toy of 1985 and 1986, some children were scared by its realistic appearance and the way it moved. Also, there were rumors that some units could speak unexpectedly, increasing fear in some children. Despite appearing innocent, the scary bear spawned many spooky stories in the 1980s. Number 7. My Buddy my Buddy was a toy released in the 1980s by Hasbro that was marketed alongside its female counterpart, Kid's sister. My Buddy was a human-sized doll with brown hair and a casual outfit. It was touted as the perfect friend for children and was supposed to help foster social skills and imagination in young children. Although My Buddy was somewhat successful upon its release, it also received some negative reviews for its somewhat creepy appearance, which many described as creepy. Additionally, its television commercial, which featured a boy dragging his doll around, sparked some fears among parents that their children might do the same. Despite this, My Buddy became an iconic figure of 80s pop culture and is still fondly remembered by many adults who grew up with him. Number 6. Atomic Energy Lab U-238 The Atomic Energy Lab U-238 is one of the most dangerous toys in history. Although it was released in the 1950s, at a time when radiation was not as well understood as it is today, its sale was suspended after a year due to safety concerns. The lab included three sources of low-level radiation. A Geiger-Muller counter to measure radiation, a Wilson cloud chamber to see alpha particles, and a spintheroscope to see particle emissions. In addition, it came with four uranium samples and an electroscope to measure radioactivity. The creator of the lab, Alfred Carlton Gilbert, claimed it was completely safe, but we now know that exposure to uranium isotopes can cause serious illnesses like cancer and leukemia. Fortunately, the dangerous mini-lab was only in circulation for a year before being taken off the market. Number 5. Taki Tina Taki Tina is a doll that appeared in an episode of the television series The Twilight Zone in 1963. In the episode, the Taki Tina doll becomes a terrifying and disturbing object for a family. The doll speaks in a creepy manner and begins to threaten the mother of the family, saying things like, I don't like the way you treat me. As the episode progresses, the doll becomes increasingly sinister and begins to physically attack the mother. The popularity of Taki Tina in popular culture has increased over the years. She has appeared in various parodies and tributes and has become an icon of creepy toys.
Number 4. Furby Furby is a robotic toy with hair that was very popular in the late 90s. In just three years, millions of units were sold, making it one of the most popular toys of the modern era. Furbies looked like owls with big ears and could talk and move. Although they were fun for many children, there were stories that sometimes they turned on and spoke by themselves, even at night. There were also rumors that even without batteries, the toys would activate and ask to play. Despite the scary stories, Furbies became available on the market again, but only in the United States. Number 3. Big Lou Big Lou was released to the market in 1963 for a price of $10, which at the time was quite expensive for a toy. Big Lou was a 94-centimeter tall robot that could say 10 phrases, had bright bulb eyes, and could shoot rubber projectiles from its hands and chest. However, many people who were children at that time were actually scared of it. Although it could have been a fun toy to play with for hours, the creepy appearance of the Big Lou robot, along with its unsettling gaze and smile, caused nightmares in children. He's ready to work for you, fight for you, even talk to you. Get the giant moon robot. Bargain price, Big Lou. Number 2. Ronald McDonald 1979 In 1979, some creepy clown-shaped toys called Ronald McDonald were produced. This clown is the mascot of the world's largest fast food chain and used to be friendly and cute. However, over time, the toys became more terrifying and were not appropriate for children. In fact, if you suffer from a fear of clowns, you should prepare yourself for what's coming next. Although the original idea of producing these toys was good, the final result was not what was expected. If you were like us, you wouldn't be able to sleep with such a creepy doll sitting next to you, you wouldn't even be able to live in the same house. Number 1. Baby Secret Doll the Baby Secret doll became very popular in the 1960s, but its appearance and voice mechanism left a lot to be desired. With a red dress and a pull ring on the back, pulling it would make the doll move its mouth and emit phrases that, for some, could be terrifying. The advertisement used to promote the doll did not help improve its image, as it showed the doll as a kind of devilish being saying things like, I want to tell you something, or I want to sleep with you. For some children, this doll could have been the protagonist of their nightmares and not exactly a playmate. And with that, we conclude the video. Thank you for watching. See you soon in a future video. But where is the love? William Stops TV subscribers, we remind you that we love you very much. Oh. Hmm.